we, we were going to do a short film. And in fact, we asked Brooke to be in it. Here we go. And she said no. What? Hey, how's it going? Welcome to It's a Hawaii Thing. I'm Lanai, and that's Brooke Lee. Hello. Thanks for joining us today. If you get a chance, follow us on our Instagram, It's a Hawaii Thing. Also, our YouTube page. You can subscribe and hit the bell. we got a very special guest today. <laughs> this guy has been in more movies, TV shows, actor, producer, um, done all kinds of things. Uh, the busy. Wing Feather Saga, uh, Jamo, Jamo Jaya. I can't see the word. Yeah, Big Sky, yeah. Uh, The Wind, The Reckoning, uh, MacGyver, The 100. Did you do Magnum P.I.? Probably. We have uh, no, 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 you didn't do Magnum P.I. Okay. Wait, you yeah. haven't done Mag. <laughs> Brent Onbe. <laughs> no, not yet. Not Paging yet. Brent Onbe. He's done Rush Hour right. in the number one, Visible, Polly Road. Uh, just let go. The list goes on. on. We're going to have to ask him about all his accomplishments. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Ian Kuzek. How you doing, Ian? I'm very good. Thank you so much for having me. You know, thanks for being here. He's zooming all the way in from I, a very far, far place. I love the Samoan accent. It. On yeah. the other side of the island. <laughs> 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 Traffic was so I'm, bad. I'm, Augie Tolba, get traffic. on that. Are you? I'm bummed. That, I'm bummed that I'm not there, but uh, maybe another time. But yeah, something happened, and I had to. Um, I'm kind of zooming um, all day. Yeah, so, he's pivoting. Yeah, I'm on. The, uh, That's yeah. okay. I'm, zoom was. I'm glad you made time for our little production. Yeah, here. I mean. Oh it's no, I really wanted to be there. I wanted yeah. to meet you guys in person. I mean, no, he no, thought I've he was going to be. I've seen you at the Blue Note. I've seen you at Blue Note. You know, oh, I love yeah? seeing you there. Yeah, I've seen you there. He's a local MC. boy. I know, I know, but it. Hi. I heckling you... me for walk, for walking out after the set. <laughs> oh, did I really? No, I didn't. <laughs> and I'm like, I'm scared. I'm like, Shh. I'm gonna stay. I'm not gonna move. I'm not gonna move. You know, if you're a comic, the my well for me, my favorite is when somebody gets up in the middle of your act. And it's you like, have to go to the toilet. You're yeah, like, oh. yeah. <laughs> like I don't go to your job and just walk up in the middle of, and I'm so just you don't kidding. Pick on people. Oh, that's all I do. No, you don't. Yeah. I've Seen you pick You've up never been to my it's show. Funny, though. As, as long as it's not, well, as as it's not me. Not yeah. Listen, when you gotta go, you gotta go, right? What you you have do? to. Yeah. It is you the United States well, of America. I, we I do have rights. I appreciate that you uh, came to the show. It's it's part of the uh, it's part of the the deal when you come to a comedy show. You're free reign for the comedy. That's right. Whatever I, you do, absolutely. people know that I, when they I come. Maybe that's why I don't go to your yeah. shows. Yeah, because you'd get picked on the whole show. Hundred percent. But but Ian, where are you at right now? I'm in the distant land of Kailua. <laughs> <laughs> mm, other you, side. You've been other way side. over the, on the other side of the island. Country, country. You've been really country, busy country. and you have an incredible voice. The last thing you did was an animation, wasn't it? Yeah, it was the wing fag. I can't even say it. That's my great voice. <laughs> <laughs> Take five. It was the wing feather saga. Yeah, and and tell everybody what that. what is that about? Oh, shoot. Now you, you put me in the spot. Um, <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> okay, just tell us what did you do in the movie? Boy, it's a voice. Uh, yeah, but what did you do? Play, no, no, no. I play I play a character t called um, Pete uh, the Sock Man, and um, Pete the Sock Man, and, like, and, and he and he has hands. And instead of as you you read the book, instead of hands, he's got um, talons, uh, and he has uh, socks on his hands, and then it will be revealed what he has on his hands. Are you allowed to tell us like, this? Are we going to get you in trouble? I'm a ritual already for saying, the, uh, yes, I am. Because okay. yeah. I just okay. want to make I'm sure I'm protecting your career. We don't ruin anything here for you. <laughs> I'm totally okay. in trouble. Hey, hey, Ian, it's that. okay. Yeah. Only Brooke's mom and my mother watch the show. So true. you're okay. <laughs> totally I, uh, not true. I, I asked this because I'm totally, I'm so fascinated she about wants to get into voiceover. voiceover. Yeah, I want to get in. obsessed. I want to get oh, over into voiceover. Obsessed. I've been doing uh, uh, radio for like 30 years and I do a lot of commercial stuff, but I want to do animation. Do you, Okay. how do you okay, get into Go ahead. Uh, I'll tell you how I got how I got this. Okay. So the, the, this is the first and only animation I've ever done, and they were looking for a character, and they showed me the picture of the character, and it was this guy with a beard and scruffy long hair, and I thought I looked at thought that's me. They ah. basically wanted the character from Lost. I used to be on the TV show yes. Lost, yeah. but that's why I came to Hawaii. They basically wanted Desmond from Lost. And they went, well, what about the guy, Henry and Houston? Because I represent him. That's what they said to my agent. Oh, and they said, yeah, oh, there you go. And that's how I got it. So I didn't really get it. See? Yes, you did. Well, you were, you were, they wrote I, the part well, for you. Well, I got it. But yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. exactly. Yeah. So when I saw the picture, I was like, it's the double. Well, then the question like me, is, me with, with talent. Do you like doing it enough that you'd want to do it again? I would. It was like doing theater again. It was mm. like so precise they would say okay do that again but let's do this say it this way da, da, da. and i i'm telling you i was we, i did a blue planet 
and oh. I was sweating. Oh. I was like an hour. I was like drenched. It was like a workout, a vocal workout. Nice. It was great. I want to talk yeah. more about this when we uh, come back. We're going to take a quick break. Don't go anywhere. Ian is hanging out with us. It's a Hawaii thing. For all your money needs, Hawaiian Financial Federal Credit Union is here for you. Visit HIFICU.com. Bringing you what matters. Viewers can receive the Star Advertiser digital full access subscription for $9.95 per month. Go to StarAdvertiser.com and click on subscribe. Use the code AHIGHTHING. Welcome back to It's a Hawaii Thing. We Do have Ian Kusin here <laughs> hanging out with us. Actor, director, producer, animation voice. Uh, you just we We're talking about this movie you voiced over. Now, the question is, when they tell you to redo the voice, do it this way, do it that way, how do you get into that character? And are you just reading or are you memorizing the lines? Are you asking an um, actor how he acts? No, I, I want to know his way. It's Okay, so so no, it's a valid question because I'm not memorizing. Like, when I'm doing ADR on, on, on TV stuff, I've already learned the lines, so they come quicker to me. But I'm reading, and I don't really know what they want me to do, so I'll just give them as many, and I'll, if I'm running, I'm, <laughs> what, do you, what do you want me to do? You know, so I'm, I'm acting. Uh, obviously, no one can see me, but if I'm moving, I'm, so I'm doing the whole thing, doing the whole shtick, and just trying to, I'm just pushing it every time, just pushing it. What it, if they give me a note, I'll just keep pushing it, to, pushing it to the nth degree. You're gonna go, make okay, that's, so. That, that's too much. Bring it you're back. gonna make so much money if you decide to keep doing this. No, he has an amazing voice. You, if you get into games, yeah, dude, have you got? You haven't gotten into CG games yet. See, and that's one of the things I, I want to get want. into. You is, did do a game. Which game did you do? Um, it was called Bioshock Four. <gasps> That's a huge uh, game, bro. I know, right? But it's um, it's not out yet, and uh, I'm, maybe I'm gonna get into more trouble now. You know, I Ian, I was reading uh, this. Is huge. I was reading this article. They did a study on voiceover work, and I don't know if you noticed, like in America, a lot of um, things that are educational, they use somebody with an accent, and it, it's because Americans right. think they it's a trusting voice and they think that they're smarter than they are are you saying ian has an accent because i don't hear an accent it's, he has a samoan <laughs> accent it's, you have the accent you you have a, a samoan have an accent, accent I, I which is nothing. amazing I hear your nothing. pronunciations are awesome american roll yeah, off the tongue <laughs> yeah i was confused if it was samoan or chinese i got them both confused but <laughs> No, but you it's true. They uh they did this study, so like in train stations and stuff. So you're saying right. if you have a European sort of Yeah, something people different. People think yeah. you're smarter? Right. Uh, they, yes. Or Americans more. do. Oh. Americans think you're smarter. They did these surveys and tests. Weird. But you have an amazing voice to do these Thank different Thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah. But do you think do you think I sound smarter? I do. <laughs> Just the way you said oh, smarter. Well, <laughs> yeah. Do you think I smell smarter? smarter? See, okay. yeah. look at you. Do you think I, do you think I sound smarter? <laughs> do you think I sound smarter? Say it like you're from Wyatt and I. What? Do you think I sound smarter? It doesn't sound hey. smart. It doesn't sound smart. Right? It doesn't, really doesn't. <laughs> Equally scary, yeah. but not. Yeah. So, so like Brooke said, are you going to do more animation? What do you What do you think you want to do? Uh, you know, it, it, I take, you know, I'm, I'm a journeyman actor now and I, if the offers come up, course i will take it you know uh -huh. if it allows me to stay here in hawaii and work from you know remotely it's the best i think that's the best part of it you don't have to go and travel 100%. that that is that is the best I think. Yeah. if you could if you could just um, have an income and do it from your home uh -huh. i have a lot of friends who have their, their little studio set up in the house and if you could just stay home and work yeah. that's the best do you think your uh agent or your people are going to start Looking for these jobs for you? Yeah, have people. You oh. Ian, people. Ian, what? I have people. Uh, people. They do. They, they, they send me up for tons of stuff. I just never booked them. Really? <laughs> yeah. Because you choose not to I shouldn't or say because that. you didn't get no, it? No, no, no. We're, that's okay. No, We're going to cut it out. I, I just... We're gonna, I just don't book them. We're gonna cut I, it out. We're gonna I cut go it out. I go for tons, tons of stuff. I just never get it. Cut it out. We're gonna well, cut it out. I, yeah, it doesn't sound like it. You got, it here, looks like you got over fifty. This is movies. what I'm interested in because it goes mm. either way. Because Matt Fox, who was on Lost, God bless him, in his ways. Uh, there, you Scott can same what thing. Is, a lot wait, of what them, do you mean in his ways? A lot of people come here. They do shows and they can't get off this rock yeah, fast enough. They, like literally, oh. Scott was the same way. Scott came here first year. He was okay. A little local. There's not a lot that leave though. A lot stay too. Yeah, I mean, yeah. but you know, it's two distinct camps. You either come and you drink yeah. the Kool Aid, you fall in love with it, you never yeah. want to leave, yeah. or you're like, get me off this island put my scenes back to back and pull me on a plane. Yeah. So yeah, clearly I, I'm the first. you're, yeah. you fell in love well, with. Well, 
Well, I grew up I grew up in Trinidad in the West Indies, and okay. my wife grew up on Isla, which is a small island. Wait a minute, you grew up in Trinidad. What's the accent? It's Scot- <laughs> It's like Scottish or Irish or something. In Trinidad? No, your your accent. My accent. So my accent is an amalgamation of Scottish, Trini, Peruvian, English. Scottish. It's just it wanders all over. Like when you hear me say Trinidad, yeah, that's how Trin- that, you that know, is that's Trinidad. Trinidad. You know, Trinidad. You know, when I say when I say Glasgow. That's a way a Glaswegian would say it. Do you know what I mean? Okay. Well, See. say, uh, would you like to have a glass of whiskey for me? Why? Would you, would you like to have a glass of whiskey for me? Because, because like Scott, you know, Scotland's famous for their whiskey. We got to take a quick oh, break. Of course. I wanted to see what it sounded like. Don't go anywhere. He's gonna do another take. He's gonna do another take when we get back. When we come back. Whiskey yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah. Don't go anywhere. It's a Hawaii thing. We'll be right back. See Dr. Oda at HEC Medical Clinic Honolulu Specialist in Laser Weight Loss. You can see the change losing 1 to 2 inches instantly. Long's Drugs is always here for Hawaii, providing your family with local favorites, accessible health and wellness services to keep you safe and healthy. Make Long's a part of your day. Welcome back to It's a Hawaiian Thing. We're talking story with uh, Ian Kusik. Trinidadian. Trinidadian, Scottish. Trinidadian. And American. Trinidadian. 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 And yeah. now Hawaiian. Yeah. I, I got to ask you, did you like doing Lost? Lost was the best job I ever had in my life. Really? And it changed my life completely. A lot of yeah. people say it that. changed it utterly, completely. Why, I, was a, I was an actor, 100,000 pounds in debt in the UK. And then it was like winning the lottery. I get to live in Hawaii. I get paid for doing what I love. I got a great role on a great show. And boom, my kids came. You know, we all live. We still live it. So it was, yeah, it was the best job ever. You know, so I watched um, season one. Mm-hmm. And then I went to season two. And I was completely lost. <laughs> so I stopped watching it. And I waited till the last season, the big finale. Yes. And then I watched it. Yeah. I was so mad. Why? Because it was just a dream. Oh, here <laughs> oh no, it wasn't. It was dream. all a dream. You're gonna get into so much. Oh, you got the wrong show. Okay, let's just yeah, move that's on that's to the next you're segment. You're gonna get into so that's, much. Let's say it elsewhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah we have we have so many uh, lost so much, fans here. Yeah, deep cuts, yeah. bro. When you get to yeah, that level, but don't even. Dream. Go, go, go watch it again. Watch yeah. It again. yeah, yeah, I'm gonna yeah, have to yeah, watch yeah. it again. Cause uh, yeah, well. Daniel Day Kim says the same thing. Changed his life. Yeah. Well, Jorge, I'm sure. Jorge I'm sure as an actor, life. it's for changed your life yeah. for sure. 100. Yeah. percent I agree. For all of us. I I it probably auditioned for that show at least 15 times. Lost. Yeah, and I didn't get. Sh- okay. Oh, we're gonna really? Like, like yeah. what TV roles did you audition for? I don't even remember. That's what I'm saying. I've been you know what uh, I'm saying? the right. casting directors. The casting directors here always say I'm the local guy with the most auditions. That means I'm a Is bad that, actor. Oh, oh so you go up a lot? Okay. I do. I go read a lot. But oh, I didn't know. So, but see, here's oh, the thing okay. with Lost. I'm doing a little, we, we were going to do a short film. and In fact, we asked Brooke to be in it. Here we go. She said no. I didn't what? Know. Uh, I didn't know you guys yeah, going to bust out my... He's going to bust I've been out trying to get Brooke right to do now. more stuff, and she's like, and, eh. And, okay. had we, had, and had we known that you were interested, we, we would have given you the role. <laughs> I would love... Anything you have, I love... That would have cut deep. That would have cut me deep. Okay. I've, uh, that would have cut me deep. I, here's, the, here's the weird situation I'm in. And you I was just act. explaining this to my... Yeah, I can't act, There's but I can things. act good enough You can act. To get, I've seen you on stage. You can thank act. You. I've seen you. Thank you. I've, got, I've gotten enough roles to get called in to do at least two or three pages. So every time I go, hey, just, I just need a line or two, they go, no, no, we don't, we're going to save you for something else. Who said So this? I've done Five O. Oh. I've done Who's Jake and the Fat Man. I've done a bunch of shows. The casting people here? Yeah, the oh, casting yeah. people. Okay. And my, my, Your my agent. The agent? Yeah, so she, if I go, how come I didn't get called for that part? She goes, it's too small. I'm like, Who what are you talking agent? about? Say name. We won't right. discuss that. Right I now. need receipts. Yeah. <laughs> Who is your agent? I thought you were. I'm not, yeah. clearly. But Ian, see, on Lost. This isn't about me. Wait, I got to get back to Lost okay. because there isn't a lot of people on the show because they're on an island. Yes, yes. So you can't audition. They don't bring, they don't have day players on that show. They, Correct I'll me if I'm wrong here. They've asked here. me for different, to do different things. Maybe not 15, but I've asked for different things. Because Lost is a pretty encapsulated set. They are deserted on an island. They're Gilligan no, Island. No, but, but, but we went different places. Different places. You know, you we, know had, we, had a, we had a lot of um, flashbacks. Uh, yeah, the flash. It was mostly flashbacks. flashbacks yeah. Okay, yeah. got it. Yeah. Okay, I'm just. Yeah, we had all over the place. Checking, yeah. checking facts so, here. So uh, the residuals must be nice.
nice, huh? Yeah. What, <laughs> yeah, what I was asked this question. So, <laughs> so the residuals, residuals get half and half and half. Yeah, half. As right. it cycles so down. So eventually, dw- eventually dwindles away too. Right. 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 Yeah. Right. I did. Uh, I got a check yesterday for um, Baywatch. I did like seven episodes of Baywatch. Mm. Oh, okay. And, uh, oh, what was it? That was the best because I got to play myself. It was awesome because it was 12 cents. Ooh, mazel. So I, <laughs> right. Exactly. That's actually a lot. I, I'm trying to look it up to see where it played. <laughs> Albania. Yeah. Oh, it probably worse. I think the it was Congo. Congo, Africa. Yeah, the Congo. <laughs> they just got satellite. Anyway, are you, so you produce, you direct. What, what do you like most? What are you um, enjoying the most? I'm, okay, I'm, I'm primarily an actor. Okay. Uh, there's something about directing um, which is also really fulfilling. Um, I would like to direct more as I get. I'm getting older now, so and I feel like I know. You know what kids come on on set i feel like I'm, i know a little bit about it because i've been doing it so long you know you guys probably know what i'm talking about and um so i would like to move into directing a little bit more but i am primarily an actor that's nice. awesome so. all right that's your passion we got to take a quick break don't go anywhere talking story with ian it's a hawaii thing we'll be right back Pacific Spray Wash is Oahu's number one trusted exterior cleaning service. We deliver a spotless job for all your pressure washing, roof cleaning, house washing, and solar panel cleaning. Bringing you what matters. Viewers can receive the Star Advertiser digital full access subscription for $9.95 per month. Go to StarAdvertiser.com and click on subscribe. Use the code AHIGHTHING. Welcome back to It's a Hawaii Thing, talking story with Ian, Henry, Ian Kusick. Why do your friends just use your middle name? Kusick. Kusick. Yeah, thank you. You're, thank you're you, Brooke. Kusick. You got it right. You're welcome. I didn't want to say. I so um, I, am, I am Henry Kusick, and um, when I became an actor, my equity name, I, I decided to get Ian. Ian, my friends always, I've always been known as Ian. Okay. But Henry, I always liked the name Henry. I didn't really like the name Ian. I thought, I'm going to use Henry. It just sounded bigger it's you know, very hollywood it is and you use <laughs> you know, three names you know it's, it's, just it's henry, very hollywood, it's a very hollywood. yeah okay but then but then when people would call me henry i would go who, who oh that's me I, <laughs> yeah. I just didn't feel like a henry so i would um i'd say I, my name is henry but just call me Ian. No, we I had, change it, we so. had a, a a local comedian he passed away one of my favorites he was like my mentor his name is james grant benton <clears throat> mm. and james grant benton was part of a group uh, booga, uh booga. the booga booga part of a group a trio anyway when I first met him, I was in awe. And one of the first questions I said is, bro, you from Hawaii? Where you got James Grant Benton? He goes, sounds cool, huh? <laughs> and I said, that sounds very cool. And he goes, that's how I got him. <laughs> awesome. So I always like to ask people how they use, why they use their three names, three names. and which one. Yeah. It's very cool. It was cool. at a time when, you know, it was like... Um uh, Daniel Day Lewis. Yes. Oh, yes. oh I, I, I want. I want to be like an. I want Henry Ian Cusick. Yeah. 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 It's very cool. Nice. Uh, is there anybody that you want really want to act with? Like, is somebody you looked up to growing up, or that maybe you oh, did boy. already? Um. Gosh. Uh, or direct. Probably. Jeez, uh, these are the questions that um I can spend all day thinking about. Um, I gro- Okay, just uh, just off the top of my head. James Spader as a young man. Oh. I remember being very blown away by him. Uh-huh. Um, I love the way he performed. Um, yeah. God, uh, I don't know. This, I, I don't know. What I are some? What are some of your favorite movies growing up? Um, favorite movies. I'm going to say The Godfather immediately because oh, that's yeah. probably God, yeah. Godfather Part Two. Nice. I could watch that all. I could watch that every time it comes on. Yeah. I'll never get bored of. You know, nice. uh, even uh, what is the, what's the other one? The Scorsese one. Uh, I'm a Goodfellas guy. Really? Goodfellas. Oh, yeah. Every Love time Goodfellas. that movie comes on, I will just watch it. No matter. I'll go. I'll say, let me just wait for the garlic scene. Let me just wait when he <laughs> smashes him in the face. Let me just wait till he walks to the restaurant. You always wait for the, the scene. You go, I'll yes. wait for this bit. And, you, and before I'm you, the you same way. Weird. It's and it's this, and you, you could be in the middle of something and it comes up on TV and then you're like, turn up the volume and then you start watching it. Yeah, it's a dude thing. Yeah. Yeah. Think, Is it? You don't like that movie? I yeah. think, oh no, I like oh, the really? movie, but yeah. I think that's your guys' chick movies. Like uh, for girls, it's like if Practical Magic comes on yeah. and you see Sandra Bullock, you're like, oh, I got to stop for a second uh, yeah, and just yeah. watch them dance. Oh, around. okay. So it's yeah. a guy thing. It's a chick You know, one of my my favorite scenes too in that one is the one where, um, after they bury the guy and they're having dinner with Danny, uh, what's his name's mom at her house. 
Oh yes, yes, yes. And that's they just right, got yeah. finished burying yeah. somebody that they murdered. Yeah, and yeah. They're having dinner. That that's right. That's right. <laughs> and, the, and the mom and, brings. And she's being so sweet. Yes. So, you want to eat? And yeah, yeah. That's a great and, scene. Yeah. So. But there's fun. always those moments you go. Let me just watch this bit again. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Or, or you look forward to yeah. What's the, what, the walking through the restaurant Mafia. scene? Oh. So you know, genius. Weird. What about something new? Have you watched something new in the last year that you, that you really liked? Yeah, Wind in the Reckoning. Have you seen yes. the movie that we shot? We ha- I'm going to watch it tonight. Yeah. I'm going to go watch it tonight. <laughs> no, you can't watch it tonight. It's only on in the cinema here in Hawaii. I That's have where you can watch it. I have ways to watch it. Do you? Yes. <laughs> you do not. Angie LaPrette texted you know? me this morning. Oh, She's please. drowning in the water. Oh, then you can watch it. With a code? <laughs> you can watch yeah. it. A yeah. private you know code? I know okay. Angie very well. Yeah, okay. yeah. Anyway, you know, you've been such a great guest. We have very uh, nice parting gifts for you today. What happened? We're we supposed to talk about Wind in the Reckoning. We're going to talk about it on the extended version of this show but while you're getting out the gifts tell everybody what it's about real quick give me the elevator pitch don't say elevator pitch oh the wind and the reckoning yes (laughs) oh okay so the wind and the reckoning it's a book uh, the true story of Koolau uh, as told by Pete Ilani Mm -hmm. and it was set in 1898 and it was uh, when um, Hansen's disease leprosy and uh, the provisional the Hawaiian provisional government were um, sending people to Molokai and um, Kolao uh, and his son were arrested. He shot the sheriff and then <clears throat> went up into the hills with his wife, Pilani, and other people joined him. And it's a love story. It's I'm so glad you guys. I'm so revolution. glad you guys are telling these stories because they need to story. be told. I know it is. You got 20 seconds. Oh. Tell him what he won. He didn't win anything. Hurry up! You got He's twenty seconds. Guest on the sh- okay. I know. Tell him. We got your shirts from Eighty Eight Tees. Oh, that's a great shirt. It's Thank from Pipeline. You. Oh, Pipeline. Yeah, Sweet. many Thank Hoonie you very Max much. coming your way. This is their new sample box. Make sure you follow nice. us on Terror YouTube. Chips. Ian Kusick. Thank, Thank you so Thank much you for guys. joining us. Congratulations on all your success. You. You're awesome. Thank I'm, I'm a huge right. fan. Okay. He's Any, gonna square in Scottish. Anytime you want to come to a comedy show, call me. I'll get you some tickets right in the front row. All right. Okay. Okay. Great. Aloha. You can hassle me. Aloha. We'll see you guys next time. Thank you. Welcome back to It's a Hawaii Thing, the extended version. Thank you guys so much for joining us. Can you us. say a swear word in Ian, Trinidadian? Ian Cusick is Trinidad- joining us today. Dead. Actor, producer, director, overall nice guy. What's a bad word in Trinidadian? Didian. Is that a word? Trinidadian. Uh, 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 Trinidadian. Uh, if I were to say to you this, it's, it's kind of bad, but you might not understand it. Marcan. Oh, oh, that sounds yeah, bad. Just sounds bad. So, okay, so here's. But, our but did you did you understand what I said? No, it sounded Filipino actually, like sort of a dessert. I I, I kind of want to take a guess. Go ahead, go. So say it one more time. Are we guess some uh, swear yeah, so, words. Hey, 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 you want to come? Yeah, it, it sounds like you're asking if you'd like a woman's vagina. No. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, when I arrived in Scotland and I was calling people that, they were huh? like, "What's he saying?" <laughs> Do you, you say it so fast. Uh, you know? and, but it, it, it's just such a phrase that we in Trinidad you say all the time. See, because, okay, know? so here's the tie to Hawaii. So when I gave up my title here in 1998, uh-huh. it hurts to say the words, uh, the girl who won, Wendy Fitzwilliams, is from Trinidad. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. So okay. she's the second Trinidadian to win the Miss Universe. Penny, forget Penny Comijon. Yes! How did I know that? How did you know She's that? My, these are my Penny sisters. Com- Penny from- Comijon was, I'll never forget it when she won. Must have been like in 1970. 19- well, it's, it's, uh, Penny Comijon, yes. because they named something after her. Like it's something. She, She's still a hometown Stadium. hero, like Brooke Lee. She, so, okay, so. She is. She, she was big, Penny Comijon. The other guy was Hazley Crawford, who won the uh, 100 meters. Anyway, that's yeah. So thing. Trinidad is like Hawaii. I yeah. mean, it's a country. Don't, of well, course, we're a country. Don't come for me. We are a Kanaka country. Maoli, Hawaii is but, our own country. Um, so yeah. So but island it's... people, island people. Yeah. Island sort of mentality, uh, and so Wendy and I are very close uh, still to this day. Oh, and okay. um, so yeah. So she. That's the only way I knew what Trinidad. You gotta hook and her up with him, and so they can meet each other. So they can. Well, do I had something no idea together. he was Trinidad. Wait, yeah. is, is Wendy, is, does she live here in Hawaii? No, Wendy lives in oh, Trinidad. She, lives, she Trinidad. lives in Trinidad. So Trinidad has the same size population. It's about a million people. Give or oh, take. really? You know? I did not. That yeah. I did not know. Is it more yeah, muggy? Little... Is it more muggy there? It's Caribbean. No, I know, but so, there, there's no so, trade wind. Okay, the big, differ- the big difference is, um, yeah, I used to think if, like, if it was 32, 32 was the nice day. Anything yeah. under 30 was cold. So that's like 92 here, right? So you spent a lot yeah. of time there? Like, did you grow up there? 
Yeah, from the age of four to fourteen. Oh wow! That's why okay. you love Hawaii. Childhood. See, so you're an islander. So you're yeah. an islander. Yeah, yeah, but but Hawaii is a lot. Um, I mean, I was very when I came to Hawaii. You had like wide streets, and you had all <laughs> electricity. Had, an American all, Western sort of you, organizational. You the, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you had all the fancy stores. Like we didn't have that in Trinidad. Nice yeah. toilets. Yeah, I get it. Relax. Yeah, Trinidad, <laughs> was, Trinidad is a lot more country than um, Hawaii. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's like uh, I just went to New Zealand. I didn't realize New okay. Zealand is New, the best way to explain New Zealand. Like ten people told me that New Zealand is a massive farm with a couple of cities in it. Okay, right. it's like more cattle and sheep than people. Well, yeah, is that right? You know, yeah. people have always said New Zealand is very like Scotland. It yes. is actually you, very much no. so because yeah. of the weather and the people. You have and every the wool. climate. A lot of wool. I think Hawaii has eleven of the thirteen climates, and so does New Zealand. But New Zealand. Is that right? Unlike Hawaii, the Maori culture, they have way more, um, what would you call it? Not rights, but. Oh, yes. Well, yeah, they, they, they they're just, their land. culture wasn't, wasn't decimated yeah. and they had to build it back up. Right. They've kept the consistent heartbeat. Yeah, but they also throughout. have their oh. issues. Whereas that I, we've had to sort of re, you know. I kind of we was tripping decimated. out on, the, you know, they have their tribes and who owns what. Man, you think Hawaiians got. Uh, the crab the syndrome. End, the These end guys, end. they're like gang violence and war against each other. A lot of them are just fighting we for stuff. We were not exactly a peaceful. That's oh, what really? I said. Yeah, that's why I say you think it, crabs Jason in a Momoa, bucket were bad they're, here. They're literally Boy, crabs in the bucket is bad there. Well, you know, very bad. It's a whole colonial anyway situation. So, what are you working on next, Ian? Um, what am I? Oh, okay. Uh. I think I'm gonna go do some NCIS Hawaii. Come yeah, up. really. Close to that. That's awesome. How have you before. not hit any I, I, magnum? I say that with. I say that with. The de- I shouldn't have said that. Maybe you should cut this because the deal hasn't closed yet. Okay. And it would be terrible. No, but if we I can manifest this, so. it. We're manifesting it. And we're on. Are YouTube. we manifesting it? Yeah. yeah. Okay. How Ma- did let's you not hit a magnum okay. branch on the way down from every other thing you've been? <laughs> How is that? That's funny. You see, on the. That's hilarious. Well, not down. down. You know what I'm saying? saying. Like no, a, I'm not <laughs> meaning like trajectory-wise. I'm, so I'm just saying. I'm just saying. You live in Hawaii. Yet, you're born. Like okay, you're you here. You have to cut this. <laughs> you live here. Like you have to seriously. Will you cut this, please? Yes. Please, please cut this. I have cut the cut editor out. sitting right here. It will be. It will be fine. But how is he not on Magnum? Yeah. Like that's not a thing. Did you have your audition for Magnum yet? The weird thing is, I, I have friends on Magnum, like yeah. the director, the DP. I work with them on MacGyver. See, uh, so no. this is what I don't. Maybe they're not friends. Oh. Uh, <laughs> oh, that's also but you know a what? Conversation. Though? That's Fri- a conversation. Sometimes bro. friends is the hardest one to get something from. Meaning? Yeah. Because then they feel like, because they may they might not have the direct decision to do it, but then they feel like uh, I don't want to ask the person that has the direct decision. Hey, go. Go uh, hire this guy. I mean, he's not. Uh, I think you're reaching. I think yeah. you're reaching. He's a, and you're not yeah. an unknown. Like, your credit's alone. I have a lot of friends they who work fly, in the business. They haven't gotten shit. No offense, because you're Howley, but you're a local guy from here. But they fly white people I in know. here to do I know. parts that yeah. he's right. literally in Kailua. But the reason and I I'm, said that was because I'm, you've done so maybe many. Maybe Kailua is too far. The, maybe. <laughs> Sag. The, the reason yeah. I say, well, Kailua, that's the problem. <laughs> the reason I say that is it's kind of like my syndrome. They <laughs> say he's too big for that part. We need to save the big part is that, for him. Is that your that's problem? probably what yeah, it is. That's it is. What it is. Is that your problem? He's too big for the yeah, You're yeah. too big for yeah. things? Yeah. yeah. Wow. Look at his resume. Yeah. Him, uh, him, I understand. Uh, you, yeah. I'm having he a hard time He needs to have a starring role in one, in, in, in one of these things. Because you the know guy. what I think Yeah, happened? and now I'm just fall, free falling down that so, <laughs> hitting every branch on the way down. Wait, let's... Except the magnum branch. Let's talk about... Let's talk about the Jamo Joya. What is it called? Because I know you got called for this. Everybody, like, what is it called again? Jamo. Jamo. So there's, there's two brothers, Jamo, Jamo and Jaya. Jaya. J- Jamo meaning, meaning James and Jaya is the other brother. Yeah, because they went wide casting yeah. here. Did you, What part did you play? Were you the music executive? Yeah, how'd you know that? Okay. What's it about? Uh, Well, so we Googled. This guy's a big deal in Indonesia. He's a rapper, this guy. Yeah. Cat? Brian, Brian Rich. And Rich is Brian. he like a, his bur- name is, is he a Barat type of like, is he like a prankster type guy or no? Is he like a real? No, he's the sweetest guy. So he's, uh, he's fascinating. He's 21 years old. His name is Brian Rich, Brian Emanuel. And uh, he taught himself to speak English off YouTube. Mm. Wow. And he started rapping. And then he, this is his first movie. He's never acted before. Plays the lead role 
phenomenal, just natural performance. And um, it's directed by Justin Sean, who now lives in Hawaii. Yeah, so there Justin. was a real Hawaiian sh shot in here in Hawaii. There's a real Hawaiian feel to it. You know, there's a lot. I mean, uh, yeah, there's a lot of um, uh, local. Uh, I remember uh, now. The, yes. the, the casting went wide. Yes. So the I was in, yeah. wide. I wasn't here when, when I had my casting. I wasn't here for a lot of them, but Justin's doing Jason Momoa's yes. show now. Yes. Yeah. Chief of all. He's yes. directing Yeah, that, there's yeah. a lot of ties to. Obviously. But this is like his story, like of his coming, because he's a viral sensation. Like this kid, this no, rapper. No, it, 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 I think his management wanted to, you know, give him a movie. Uh, but he's a big deal. A story. Like he, he's a fa so, he yeah, virally he's massive, massive, massive on on, yeah. uh, you know, like massive. And then all of the, the Chris Lee's a producer, like Justin Sean, like this whole team. And then you were like, who is this guy? And then it's like, oh, it's an internet guy making a movie. And then people were like, what is this movie? Is it like a spoof movie? What? Yeah. What? And now it's blowing up. Like Sundance, they couldn't get tickets. You couldn't get tickets to see. The screening of is it, it. on like a platform right now? Not yet. I don't oh, think yeah. so. Is it out not yet? Not yet. Uh, There's like a bidding no. war happening. It's like so insane. they filmed well, the guess, whole thing yeah, in Hawaii. It hasn't been sold yet. But but you say he's a viral. He played Coachella, or play or, or one of those. Did big he festivals. really? Right. Was it Coachella? He played some massive, massive. When he would tell me about the festivals he played in and the amount of people he's played to. Right. I mean, he's a big. He's a big time rapper, and he raps in the in the movie, not as his character as this different character mm. yeah but um but uh it's a it's a really it's a beautiful story about a father and son relationship so, so it's not life it's not based on his life it's not a but it's not, not, at all. not at all does it take place in it's hawaii the setting is hawaii the sweating is hawaii he's filming his album he's uh recording his album in hawaii okay like a lot of a lot of artists will come to hawaii to record yeah. he's one of those artists and i play the kind of <clears throat> the kind of asshole uh uh <laughs> owner of the studio i see uh living in living in hawaii ah and, so uh, like a yeah. no nope, not gonna say it which studio but we know what, <laughs> oh, wait, oh which studio we know what who we're say. talking about there's here hawaii you go ahead fill in all the blanks yeah uh that's <laughs> interesting i'm gonna i'm gonna when did it uh come out it hasn't yet oh it hasn't it's come out. out yet okay oh well it's out in sunday it just came out in sunday yeah. last week yeah go they were they were yeah. at sundance i'm gonna go look for it thing and it was i mean and you know chris we love you chris lee chris is like he's a hype guy like that's his whole thing from Hollywood days but oh like, Chris is doing great stuff in Hawaii yeah, yeah. but he had posted because you couldn't get tickets there was yeah. like a bidding war happening like it was like one of the like most talked about things that they were like looking at and people were saying it's coming off of you know Golden Globes and Michelle Yeoh winning and you know there's like we're in another Asian golden but it was shot moment, in Hawaii right? but are they, are they saying they're in Hawaii yeah yeah it's, yeah it's, oh, that's yeah. good I like yeah, that because it's I this, this studio is in Hawaii I live, my character, Michael, lives in Hawaii. Ah, okay. Yeah. No, because I watched so. uh, Shotgun last night, Shotgun Wedding. Mm. Oh, that wait. new one with J-Lo and what's his name? And I was so mad because I was watching and go, oh, right on. They're, they're in the Philippines. And then the actors, the Filipino actors, they weren't from the Philippines because the accent wasn't oh, authentic. Filipino. But they were doing a Filipino, Filipino accent. accent. Like they should have got Joe Coy to do that. Or they should have <laughs> got Joey Gila to do that part. But anyway, I waited to the end and it was shot in Dominican. Oh. The oh, whole thing. I thought you were going to say shot in Hawaii. I thought it was Dominican or Dominica? You, Whatever. You, you, usually can, you can usually tell as soon as you see the mountains in Hawaii. Yeah, yeah. So 100%. Yeah. That, that was no shot. one believes that was, me. But, that but I thought true. the close the close-ups were shot here. Some of the close-ups. But anyway. Yeah, I hate when they do that. What Hawaii for somewhere else? Or they say it's the, yes, where they say it's the Philippines and then they're in oh, somewhere else. It's very or, difficult to shoot in the Philippines, love. Well, there's a lot of movies being shot in the Philippines. Yeah, but it's you know, it's not that difficult. It's very cheap and affordable. Donnie Dawson yeah. would disagree. And it's cool you because you can get a, <laughs> you can get a hundred people to do one job. It's Donnie's awesome. like, you could come here and do that. <laughs> we could work out a deal. I do a lot of stuff in the Philippines. It's way. So anyway, oh, what do you like about okay. the the food in Hawaii? What's your favorite? Your what have you taken to? What is your go-to? Oh gosh, uh, for a while I was eating poke every day. Oh, oh, good job. Um, that could be a problem. Did you have your? That day? is a problem. Did you have your lead Do tested? Have... <laughs> okay, yes, I did. Okay, it's and that's a thing. Why... Okay, so okay, I, Who okay, cares? I, swear to God. I it was is a I thing. was eating poke every day. It's dangerous for lunch, right? Yeah. Oyster, uh, avocado, right? Uh, from Foodland, and and then I did. I got my my levels tested. And they were like something like thirty six. Yeah, it's, it's and I was and it's, Fukushima, I was like, what, what are think. they supposed to be? They're supposed to be under ten. Yeah. So then I gave it up, and uh, and then I went vegan. Wow. Uh, for a while, and um, because I was really only eating fish. And now you're you know, and now you're month. unhealthy. <laughs> and now and, and no, then I and and now I'm healthier than I've ever been in my life. No, yeah. then I um I went to Thailand 
and I couldn't get any vegan food uh, in Phuket. And uh, so I what do you mean? Again. You couldn't really? In Phuket, every, they put fish on everything: fish sauce, fish flakes, everything. Mm. I thought I'll just have fish. Uh, and then, but in Bangkok, in Bangkok, the vegan food there vegan is everywhere. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I, I was about... thinking about so Vegas. good. Yeah. Oh, because I love yeah. the food over there. Phuket, yeah, Phuket is very different from Bangkok. Though. I didn't know that. Yeah. yeah. So you. So Bangkok's, now, now, yeah. what are you eating in Hawaii? What's your favorite dish since you don't eat poke? By the way, you should no, no, keep no, eating no, I, it. I've gone back to eating fish. Oh, good, good. So now, now I eat poke. Good. Now, because, you just have to be in moderation. Yeah. Yeah. I always tell people, yeah. you know, because a few people have been talking um, about yeah. that whole lead thing. and It's I'm, not a uh, thing, bro. It's no, for real. It's been like this forever. I'm just saying like salmon always had this or that, depending where you get it from. Uh, what I'm saying is, so you don't eat that, but you go and drink a soda or you have coffee. Well... And you put deodorant. You're getting the same thing. You're not getting lead. You know what I mean? Yeah, we had lead I as mean, kids in school, and, and we put lead it's, right on our hands. It's not stuff. like everyone can afford <laughs> to have ahi poki all the time. Yeah. But like, you get my point, though. I'm just saying. It's you in moderation. Knock out it's everything. always gonna be yeah. No, it's yeah. always point. in it's moderation. It's always gonna be something bad. Yes. Yeah, you're right. I think in moderation. So now I'm much more. Uh, I have. I'm much more vegan. Yeah. I mean, I still eat poke, but I'm much more vegan now so, than I'm. Than so because I, I I'm I'm 52 now. And and I don't really care anymore because I only got what ten years left. So I'll just eat whatever makes me happy. <laughs> Did you if just it say makes you, you have happy, ten years left? That's what two psychics said. Oh lord! Yeah. So you guys be oh, really? nice to me. Yeah, I got like two, two, ten years left. And then you're gonna bring out life. the jacket. And I'm really healthy. You should ask him one day. Yeah, but but you want but you want your last ten years to be you don't want to be like you know sick. No, yeah, I know I'm not sick. You, not, I work out every day. No, I'm in the food the business. The healthiest he's ever been. So I right. I eat okay, whatever but... I want. So I, I work out so I can eat whatever and I want. And then he takes the the vitamins in his in his. I do IV drip IV once drips. a month. He's like addicted. Oh, you yeah. do that? Yeah, yeah. yeah. he's addicted. It's you it's know why? Because I'm not a good uh, pill swallower. Pill popper. He's right. A yeah, liar. I don't like taking so you, pills. You take, so you you spend all day fundamentally lying. What's that, an no, hour thirty thirty minutes, and then I'll get a whole bag of everything that I need for the. Yeah, I tried that. Did you feel anything? Did you feel anything? So this is what I didn't feel anything. This is what you're gonna, gonna feel. Make you go. No, I'm not gonna make you go at all. It's everyone's different. It, what I feel is I don't, I because I fly so much, I don't feel right. dehydrated like I you, when I don't do it. It's the flying. Yeah, it's the flying. Uh, not the hangover. Makes you dehydrated. Okay. And but do I, you drink on the flight? Do you? No, do you drink no, only you water. Don't drink, at all? don't drink liquor at only all. Water. Until yeah. he gets wow. there. Until I get there, then <laughs> I have then some whiskey. You make up for it. Right. <laughs> I'm a big wino and whiskey guy. What kind of whiskey you like? So, um, gosh, my cooking whiskey is Jack. Okay. You know, I'll just drink that. But if I'm drinking, you know, stuff like that, I'll drink Bunahaven or um, Lafroig, um, anything Lafroig. from Isla. My wife is from Isla, so I get all the Isla malts. Nice. Um, Odd Bag probably is one of my favorites. Do you like Japanese um, whiskey? I don't know it well enough. I've tried it, and I couldn't tell you the name. Let's go have whiskey but, uh, one night. And okay. then he's going to yeah. sit you down, and then he's going to tell you that he has only Educa 10 years left. And then he's going to tell you the story. And I'm warning you now. <laughs> he's going to tell you the story about jackets and oh, <laughs> and how jackets. he's going to put coins in his jackets. And when he dies, he's going to give these jackets to people, and then they're going to have to find the coins. It's fascinating, and it's really like a National Treasure movie waiting to happen. But he'll get drunk enough. He said it sober on the show. We've had tape, and we'll roll the tape at one point. But oh, okay. Yeah, it's this jacket story. I have a really good you, idea. And it's really... Wait, is it the jackets and the, the money's in the lining? And you yes. have to go, what is that? No, he no, has well... a whole rabbit hole. Like, he's thought about it so uh, much, he literally, it makes you concerned. Yeah, like it's concerning. But your son loves the idea. My son is fascinated. Yeah. He's writing a script as we speak. No way. Be... I was gonna say, can I? Can it? Can it be a movie? Yeah. Please take a it shot at it. It will be his thesis probably when he Please graduates. Please take a shot at it. It's gonna. Program. It's gonna yeah. cause so much hysteria at the it's same time, bizarre. so much happiness. It's bizarre. Yeah. Yeah, but he's thought a lot about it. This is his opus magnum, is that what it's called? I don't know Something what, like but that. jackets. We should, we, we, should film, we should film it. Film it. And then when you I die, need, release it. I need someone yeah. to write it because it, what's going to happen is when I die, that's the when it's going to blow up because I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, that's what I mean. Yeah. It's the money jacket. So we have right. 10 years. We have about... You have about nine years to write it. <laughs> nine years to write it. TikTok, yeah. my man. TikTok. Yeah. So let's go have Talk some to me whiskey. About it. I, I'd, I'd like to. I'd like to take a shot at it. Yeah. Okay. Ja jackets. I'd love for you to do it. I'm telling you, jackets. Well, uh, let's go thing. have some whiskey. <laughs> Just um, set this whole thing up away. I'm I'm leaving to the Philippines in like two weeks, so let's go next week if you have time. Okay. In your busy schedule. I'm here schedule. until yeah. I'm here until April. Okay. Now, also, I'd like to pick your brain on uh, doing animation. Here we go.
Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> and I just like to sit but, down and listen to your voice because you have an awesome what, voice. Gonna, I love people's voices. I'm gonna make him say who his agent is at some point during the season, Hawaii. This is my goal. Yeah. You will find out who Lanai's agent is. We'll. we'll so easy. Posted. Just Google it. Wait. I, I yeah, love. It's Kat, it's Kathy it's Muller. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? That was my first uh, agent. Hello. When Not I was 17, lie. she was my first agent. Not a lie. All right. Yeah, and then uh, by 21, I and figured out that she. So it's only... not Kathy Muller. No. I the process of elim elimination. Yeah, yeah. You, it you out. got two left. It's ADR. Yeah. So <laughs> that was my second agent. Amos, <laughs> Amos Kodamori. Yeah. Okay. No, 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 I didn't have Amos. Okay. But but it's so funny because uh, Kathy Muller, she was my first agent. Mm. After I got to like, I was doing like commercials and stuff. Mm. You know, some small stuff. Yeah. Oh, I did. She got me Baywatch, I think. Okay. So anyway. After a while, I figured out that she was only booking six-foot models. And every time I go to the office, there was like me and six-foot models. They were and, I'm, right. and Ian, I'm five foot six. So, you know what I mean? I was right. like, oh, Good I don't here. belong yeah. here. I'm not getting anything. So, I left. Oh, that's why you were right, angry. And yeah. I never met Kathy before in my life. Oh, Hi, wow. Kathy. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Never met her. That's no. the worst. She's right? a lovely, lovely human. I heard she Yeah, is. she's great. Ian, are you There's on? nothing worse than, yeah. Huh? When you say, say who, who is that? That's my agent. You know, I'm <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm right here. I'm Ian, are you on the uh, the social media stuff? Do you do like TikTok videos and Instagram? No, <laughs> uh, I do Instagram. Yeah. Instagram. What, yeah. Tell everybody what your gram is. Uh, gram. It's Henry and Cusick. That's what they say now. Is it what they say? Yeah. What they say? What's the gram? Oh, okay. Henry, Henry just spell, it's not no Ian. Yeah, Henry Ian Cusick. Oh, Henry Ian Cusick. Okay. okay. Just Henry. His name. All right, I'm following you right now. That's uh, his name. Okay. I'm going to be sending right. you whiskey videos. Oh, and you guys can bond because uh, Ian took a shot at me when he was like, you only follow seven people. Like, what is that? That's right. I forgot that. I was like, he's what like, is that what's, about? what's follow... happening with you? And Ian, I was like, are you kidding me? <laughs> She's uh, Ian. She follows no one. I what do you mean? I didn't follow anybody no. until I... BTS got on Instagram, which was late last year. Oh, I that's followed right. Zero people. And you yeah, gave yeah. me heat for that. Yeah. She don't follow so me. I don't follow so, people. Ian, I've known her since she was 15. But why? Why these seven? Why she BTS? thinks she's why Oprah. I'm not Oprah. I follow <laughs> the boys from BTS because they started on Instagram, and I was an army member and a fan. Yeah. And they asked all of us to to follow them because they had just started their Instagram accounts. Not that they'd had any problem finding followers. So as an army member, I followed only seven. Before that, how many followers did I? Zero. Oh, zero. So she really follows them because they give good makeup tips. It's not that. It's, it's literally part of our. But why, why? Why wouldn't you follow? Why wouldn't you follow Lanai, for example? Uh, this is a loaded question. I didn't. <laughs> I didn't follow anybody. Seems like a question. I didn't follow. I had okay. zero. I followed nobody, mostly because I disseminate information. She's cuckoo. That's why. But I didn't want right. to receive any information. I didn't want to see. Yeah, but you don't it. have to see it. You don't. You, have, just, you can, don't have to look you can, at it. Your feed you can, is literally. If you don't follow anybody, oh, there is I no see. one on the feed. I've got you. You see. Right. Well, you don't have to look. Yeah. At so you it. send the kahea out into the pali, but you don't have to hear you, what comes back. To but you can you. mute. You can mute people. Yeah, you, you can. can. But yeah. like, are you guys so muting people? So you don't people? have to see that. I am muted. You guys have right. hundreds of thousands of followers yeah. on your thing. You spend the time to mute. Ian, you got a you got a quarter million followers. That's a lot of people to mute. Can I be your thousandth following? I'm gonna I'm gonna follow you right now. Look at that. Ian Kusick is following you. I'm, 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 I'm not following Brooke, though. Yeah, good. <laughs> I stopped following her, too. I, 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 I actually I blocked her. You right actually now. did stop following me. But, um... I am following Brooke. <laughs> Ian, do me a favor. Block her. Oh, my God. I'm not even ever on it anymore. I, I actually mute her. I'll just mute her. Oh, just wow. Mute her, right. Okay. Now you guys are really bonded over your whiskey and jackets. <laughs> whiskey and jackets. Ian, thank you so much for taking time out of your thank busy you. schedule today. It was today. fun. It was you, nice meeting you guys. It's nice meeting Nice I, I, I'm being you. honest. If you want to come to a, a show, let me know when you want to come to a show. I, I'd love to I do want out. to come to a show. Yeah. I love come. Uh, listen, I love live comedy. I watch all the Netflix stuff, you know. Oh, awesome. And you're not. And you're you're really not quite. You're not that scary in in, in real life. You're quite nice. <laughs> he is. Thank you. Yeah. That <laughs> my uh, my whole stage thing is just an act. No, it's not. Yeah. Yeah. You see, um, good actor. Yeah. Do you have any questions for Brooke? We like, this is a new uh, thing on our show. Is there one oh, question you'd like that to ask? Yeah. yeah. Question. Yeah. yeah. This is my question to Brooke. Brooke, will you follow me on Instagram? <laughs> oh, good question. <laughs> as pressure is, as good pressure question. does. Answer now. Wow. It's, a, it's, a, it's a yes or no. Contractually, yes or no. I can't. I can only follow seven. Oh, my gosh. So I'm Ian, sorry. I can't. Block her. Don't be friends with her anymore. <laughs>
<laughs> hey, Ian, I'm so glad we met and uh, so proud of you, even though we just met. And um, <laughs> thank you. Thank you for everything Appreciate that it. you do. Keep putting out. I look forward uh, to your future productions. Uh, great together. stuff. I'm going to yes. go watch the movie. Beautiful. Tell everybody what movie that they need to watch. <laughs> Go watch Wind in the Reckoning in, the in Reckoning. Hawaii. Yes. That's one of your local cinemas. Quickly. It's going to end soon. soon. Yeah. Wind in the, I'm going to go this weekend. I'm looking at you. I okay. really, really want to see right. it. Because I've been hearing about it. Angie told me about it. Yeah. Uh, Brian sent me a thing for it. Yeah. For the, uh, That's why I the went. The premiere thing. But I wasn't here. I wasn't uh, here. It was, yeah, a, good, I it was here. a good night. Yeah. It was a great night. Yeah. yeah, yeah Brian. Yeah. You know Brian Keolana? He knows yeah. Brian. Yeah. yeah. One of my yeah. good friends. Yeah. Did you go to Makaha yet? And did he drown you? Try to drown you? No. Uh... Did he drown me? Uh, no, he didn't. No. <laughs> but he was safety, wasn't he? Oh, he's the best. He, he, was on, he was on Lost. No, he is the best. Yeah, he's, the best he's been in the on world. every show you've he's ever worked yeah, on. Yeah, I, I, I worked with him on Lost, and yeah. then I did a short film, Dress. He worked on that with the oh, video, yeah. and he came and did all the sound for the water safety. He is the water, He is the best. He is the guy. In, in the, the business. World, in, in the, the world. Business. He teaches world. everybody. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, Ian. Uh, make sure you guys follow him on uh, Instagram and go check out his movies. You thank you guys so much for watching. Make thanks. sure you subscribe to the channel. Don't click that little bell. Leave Brooke a comment, Don't a comment. nice comment. Don't comment. Yeah, Hawaii. I, I only got ten everything. years left to live, so leave a nice <laughs> comment as well. We'll see you guys next time. Ahui ho. It's a